All right, guys, this is Jonathan from Strathclyde Sport here, and this is going to be a 10 minute exhale workout. Now, if you need to cool down, you can check out our links um, in the, the, the libraries and also on, online for a warm up first. But firstly, we're going to go through the four exercises that we've got. We have got four exercises for you. First one's going to be a squat. Now, I'm just going to demo it first. Squatting down, driving up. Just getting your hips down in line with your knees, using your arms at the same time, keeping your chest up and driving through your heels. The next one, we're going to go down on the floor for this one. We have a press up. Now, they've got different options. The hardest option is on your toes, shoulders in line with hands. Put your belly button into the spine, squeeze your glutes. Bring your chest down to elbow height. Push up, too hard, down to the knees, too hard still. Bring your hands down and just push up in this position. Moving on to the third exercise, we have a burpee from side on. We're going to jump up, jump down, 180 turn, hard version. If you want it easy, plank position, in and out, turn round, in this position here, and then turn round again. Then we work the core in this position here. We have a plank, just like the press up, but this time your shoulders aren't going, chest is going all the way down. We hold as tight as you can, that's too tough. Drop down to the knees. Make sure your body weight's forward. Shoulders in line with hands in this position, all right? Okay, we're gonna go through each exercise for three rounds, 30 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Are you with me? Are you ready to get going? Three, two, one, let's go. Squatting down for 30 seconds here. Now take your time as you do this. Drive your knees out, sit back all the way and driving your feet into the floor, chest up. Now you take your time. Nice and easy, we've got 10 seconds. Let's get going everybody, can we get a bit deeper? Drive those knees out if you can, brace in the core, hips back, two, one, and stop there, well done. Shake it off, you have 10 seconds. Just enough time to get you going into the press up position. Now remember, you could decide to either do this on your toes or your knees, we're going to do it on the toes, if you want, or the knees. Pushing up, driving through, chest to elbow height. Now part your fingers and squeeze your core too tight. Now, if that's too tough, now remember the options. Drop to your knees and press up, guys. 10 seconds. Now, can we actually see if we could really drive it through for the next 10 seconds? Three, two, and one, well done. All right, we're up on our feet again. Shake it off, 10 seconds. Now we're gonna move on to the lovely dynamic move called the burpee 180. All right, from the side, we jump round, in, turn round. It's kind of a 180 turn. Now try not to get a bit dizzy doing this. Now remember the easy option. We step into the plank, back in, then we walk round, we do it again. Nice and easy, brace the core, squeezing the glutes. 10 seconds, well done, almost there, two, and one, well done, shake it off, excellent, now we move into the last one, we're going to work the core, for this one we're going to go back down on the floor again, we're going to work the core in this position, the plank position, are you ready, 30 seconds, shoulders in line with hands, still the same position, there's a press up, but we're pulling our belly buttons into the base of our spine, Going really tight hold. Now remember, option, drop to the knees, body weight forward, brace the core, shoulders in line with the armpits. Almost there, 10 seconds. How are we doing, gang? Count it down with me. Four, three, two, and one. Excellent, all right, that's round one done. Fairly easy. Now if you've got a bit of water, take a breather. We're coming back in 30 seconds and counting. We're going to do the same thing again, but what we're looking for here, can we go deeper in the squat? If we're doing it nice and easy, can we go a bit quicker? Can we sit in the, the, the press up and get the full position in that press up or down our toes? 10 seconds, everybody, then we're going to go into round two, all right? We have three rounds, we've done one already. Round two, you ready? Party your feet, 10 to two, two, one, let's go. All right, nice and easy, 30 seconds back again. Now this time, what you can do, drive your knees out to sink your hips lower. Brace your core all the way. We're going for 30 seconds once again. Can you sink your hips down and lengthen the knee just about here and then drive up. 
Lovely. Let's get that full range. 10 seconds, all the way down and up. Now you don't have to go fast to get that really good technique. You can take it easy and get the good range. Two and one, shake it off, well done. Excellent, now we're back to the press up. I'm gonna start nice and easy here, you ready? Let's go. All right, shoulders in line with hands in this position. Tuck your elbows in and keep your hands in line with your armpits. So we're just about here in this position, okay? All right, we're almost there, 15 seconds. Now, for you guys doing it on your toes or your knees, can we do the last 10 seconds? On here, pushing back, driving your hands into the floor. Two, one, drive up, done. Excellent, all right, we're back up. How are you feeling? Are we getting a bit warmer now? Second round, we should be, okay. If you remember the sequence, we've got two more. We've got plank 180. So from this position, from the front on, we turn round. Now you can turn to the side, which I'm gonna do here. Now remember, I'm gonna do this nice and easy. Plank position, out, out, in, in. And I turn round, okay, bend down. Out, out, in, in, lovely work. Squat down, out, out, in, in. Now, as you drive your feet out and in, brace your core nice and tight. Squeeze your glutes in this position. Last one. Two and one, shake it off. 10 seconds, now we move into the plank position. Work in the core, squeeze your glutes all the way, all right? So, body weight forward. Two, one, let's hold. Now, for that previous round, if we were doing it on your knees, can we get onto the our feet, tippy toes, pull your belly button, squeeze nice and tight, looking good. What we were doing out there, stay with it. Less than 10, squeeze nice and tight, squeeze your glutes. Three, two, one. Ah, well done, lovely work. Do you know what? We've done two ready, we're in that final one. All right, so we worked on a technique, round two, trying to get as deep as you can. We're gonna go even more deeper, okay? If you can actually get the range and a bit of speed, awesome for this final round, okay? Try and work as hard as you can, and at all times, work within your intensity zone, okay? We've got less than 10 seconds. This first one, as you already know, we're moving back into the squat. Two, and one. Down, okay, all the way down. Those first two rounds, would have prepared and warmed up your body for this last one. Now, all times, you could take a break when you need to, take a water break at any point that you have to. This is your workout, this is your intensity, and it's different for everybody, less than 10 seconds. Can we go in even deeper? Now, if you could only go deeper, but slowing down, that's fine. We're looking for range, two and one, well done. Okay, 10 seconds, then we switch over to the press up, all right? So we're working the chest, and we're working big muscle, muscle groups here, and a press up. Two, one, push up and drive up. Now pull your belly button to the base of your spine and squeeze or drive your hands into the floor all the way. Now remember, if you're tiring, fatiguing, don't worry about it. Go down on your knees and maintain that good technique. We don't want to see this. Bring your body weight forward, space your fingers out and drive into the floor. Last couple on your toes. Three, two, one, lovely work, okay. Body should be starting to get a bit more warmer now. Okay, two more and then we're done. All right, so burpee, now remember, jump in and jump out and then turn round. That's a hard version, now we wanna squat down, get the hips nice and low, chest up and then turn round. Don't want the hips going out, squat down, drive the knees out. This position and then turn round, lovely. Okay, turn round, lovely work. Squat down, now you notice how low I'm going. I'll say the squat did it for you. Drive your knees out and in, turn round, almost there. Two, one. Would you look at that? On to the last one. Okay, plank position. Shoulders in line with hands. Here's a really good one for you. Can you hold it for 30 seconds? Let's go, this is your challenge for the end of this small wee turkey here. Now watch. Shoulders in line with hands, body weight forward. I'm not here, it's not too high. Bring them down, forward, and hold. 
Pull your belly button in. Squeeze your hands in. Complete core. Almost there. Squeeze your glutes. Two. One. Well done. Excellent work. Shake it off here. Now, for cool downs, you could refer to our exercise library also for cool downs. But we want to shake it off here. Nice and easy. Deep breaths through the nose, out through the mouth. Just marching the spot all the way. We don't need to jog on a spot, nice and easy, just slight easy, easy steps. Deep breath in the nose, out through the mouth. All right, at the same time, keep the legs moving, one arm comes across. Lovely work. And the other arm comes across for you. Good. Now we take the palm of the hand, down to the base, in between the shoulder blades, and just hold this position. Deep breaths of the nose, just keeping the body moving. Deep breaths of the nose, if the nose, just allowing it to lower gradually. Let's switch over again. Or you could take hands around in this position if you want, if you're really, really flexible. Excellent. All right, so if you're warm like myself, wipe yourself off a wee bit, shake it off. Now what we wanna do, stop the legs, one foot forward. Turn to the side so you can see me, one foot forward, one foot back. Hand on the bent knee, drive your hips backwards and upwards, head in line with spine, keep your head neutral. Good, hold. Let's switch over to the other side. Lovely work. Now here comes a hard bit, actually using your glutes or cords to balance yourself. Now if you've got something to hold on to, like myself, hold on to your ears. It's the best way of doing it. Ah, look at that. Switch over to the other side. You get it here. Third try lucky. There we go. Hold on to the ears. Good. All right, last two. Clasp your hands. Wipe the sweat off a wee bit. To in. Thumbs to the back of the room. Shoulders down. Drive your hands back. Open out your chest like you've really done a workout. And well done for sticking with me till this far. All right, a couple of torso twists. Now remember to lift your heel as you rotate your body from side to side. Deep breaths in the nose, out through the mouth. Body warm, obviously hydrate through the workout and hydrate at the end to allow your body temperature to lower and cool down as much or as long as you have to. Now if this cool down is not sufficient enough for you, check out more cool downs in our exercise library when you do this workout. Very, very important. And also make sure you do the workout. You've got no obstacles around. You want to always make sure that you do the warm up and the cool down before you do this exercise, all right? Very, very important for you to listen to and to adhere to. Okay. All right, guys, shake your hands off, shake your legs off. Thank you very much. Hope you enjoy that workout. Take care.